Well, Oshkosh police are still trying to figure out who stabbed two students near the UW Oshkosh campus. That was on Friday night. It's one of six incidents in the area during the last month. Officials say they've now arrested one person who may be responsible for two of those incidents. The first was a robbery that happened October 20th. The second happened last night. Police say the suspect hit a man who was walking with his friend on McKinley Street. But authorities say they aren't sure if this suspect is responsible for the stabbings. Students expressed their concerns about the recent incidents with Fox 11's Gabrielle Mays. It's hard to find a student at UW Oshkosh who doesn't know about the recent robberies and assaults in the area. Blaine Wolf lives off campus. He says he was home last Friday night when two male students were stabbed. I did see plenty of officers out. Um, they were actually scouring yards looking for either something or someone. Police say they have one man in custody and are looking for at least one more suspect. However, police aren't sure if the same suspects are responsible for all of the incidents. Meanwhile, the UW Oshkosh campus police chief says his department has increased security. What we're trying to do in those areas off of Elmwood Avenue and on the east side of campus is just showing a real good uniform presence to make people feel safer when they're moving about on campus and near campus. Some students say they're not worried. I feel relatively safe. Others still have concerns. I have a class that ends about 9 o'clock at night, so it's pretty dark outside by then. I I don't feel safe walking at home, so there's Safe Walk that I plan on calling. Safe Walk is a program for students and staff with 42 trained community service officers available at night. They just have to call our department, then we find out where they are, where they're going, and their affiliation with the university, and then we go pick them up. And we do the Safe Walks within about a five block radius of campus. Here are the facts. From September 1st to October 26th, there have been 280 safe walks. 192 safe walks have been given since September 27th when the first assault happened on campus. More than 5,000 phones have registered with the school's text message alert system. And there have been more than 10,000 downloads of the most recent version of the UWO On The Go mobile app, which includes safety features. In Oshkosh, Gabrielle Mays, Fox 11 News. Anyone with information about this recent assault is asked to contact police. That number is 920-231-8477.